Welcome back all to part three of my Tabs Universal Unit Warfare series. This is part three of seven. Tonight we have for you the Jousters versus the Archers, the Halberds versus the Stoners, the Headbutters versus the Giles, Giles, I don't know, and the Fencers versus the Clubbers. Let's get going! Right, first up we've got the Jousters versus the Archers. So the Jousters are obviously men with spears on horses. There's just the four of these. Again, this is all done so that um, the, the value of the people points-wise is comparable. So these guys are worth, I can't remember what they're worth. Um, but yeah, all these archers are comparable points to uh, those jousters. So we've got 30 odd, I think it's 30 odd archers up against four jousters. So this does seem rather imbalanced. Right? That's what the game says, so we, we go with it as usual. So let's see how this goes. See if the jousters can do any damage at all. Three horses down inside 10 seconds. This guy. <laughs> Little slap and tickle there with his uh, with his jousting spear on his archer. It's not done him any damage whatsoever though. Literally just giving him a cheeky little prod. He's not even down. Oh, far side we have got a horse throwing himself in the water without even hitting anyone. I think brilliant work. Uh, and I think they're out. So well played. Within what 30 seconds, the jousters are pretty much done, and they are going to go out of the map. And the archers still have the cheek to have a shot at him, even though he's, he, they're dead and buried. One archer. Oh, there's one more on the horse on the right hand side there. And oh, he's gone as well. Brilliant. Well well played, Jousters. That was awful. Fight. I think this is probably a done deal, but hey, let's give it a go. See if that Jousters can do any better this time. And there's three horses down already. And at least one actual Jouster person down as well as his horse. This guy's got one else going on there. Dragging someone along with him. Oh, we're going in the water again. Nailed it. Jousters suck, man. I expected them to be a bit better than this, but they are terrible. Right, okay. So there's one left somewhere here. There he is, look, in the middle there. Taking on all comers, which is the entire level. Oh my god, all the archers versus one person. Kills one, killed by getting shot in the ankle. Weak. Jousters, that is poor. Right, next up we have the Halberds versus the Stoners. So as you'll see here, the Halberds have all mightily huge axes, pretty much twice the size of them. They swing down on their opponents. These guys literally throw rocks at them. But again, there are a lot more of these guys than there are the Halberds, but the Halberds are vicious. They're pretty much one-shot kill, so to speak. If they make, con they make contact with those axes, the people are dead. So we'll see how this one goes. What can we do, Stoners? What can we do? Ooh, straight in the midriff. Okay, those boulders are pretty... Oh, one to the knee there as well. These boulders are pretty vicious to be fair, aren't they? They hit, they look like they hurt. But that halberd took two or three and didn't go down. Oh, jeez. He's gone down that time. This one... Oh, right in the face. Wow, these stones are accurate with their, with their, uh, with their throwing. <gasps> oh, to the face. Halberd to the face of the stoner. Here comes another one. Oh, it's not quite on the face, but he's down. There's another one gone. Oh, these are horrible. This is like, this is like executioners. Oh, that's right in the middle of the face. Another gone. Oh, it's painful to watch. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. Poor stoners. Poor stoners. I don't know. I kind of feel... Oh, taking his teammate out. Sacrifice a teammate to take down the halberd who's not gone down. Teammate on the floor still alive, though. So, fair play. Oh, another one in the stomach there, and another one. Oh my god, these rocks are, are vicious. Wow, done. One nil. One nil already. Go on, stoners. Hell of a start. Here we go again. Round two. Can the Halbers fight back? Oh, they're so accurate. The stoners are so accurate from the start. They've taken out the whole front line. Oh no, they haven't. They haven't yet. They're still up. They haven't taken them out. I thought they'd all gone then, but they're back up again. And there goes one. Okay, now they have. <laughs> oh dear. These four guys have got quite a lot of walking to do before they get there. I mean, the stoners don't throw that quickly, but in that larger numbers, two down. Two down there. The stoners just are just biding their time, waiting for the perfect opportunity just to throw one in the crotch, aren't they? Get ready for it. Who's throwing next? You're not. You're down. There's just so many of them lined up. I mean, the halbers look totally outnumbered here. The second they have their next uh, their next round of boulders, these guys are looking pretty stuffed. But hey, you never know. At least the halbers are swinging fairly quickly. Oh, another one right in the face. Oh, 
but from the floor, uh, she, she, he or she's launched one back into them. Two down. Oh, he's. Is he done? Oh, off the back of the head, into his side. It's one versus ten. This halberd is doomed. What can he do? Good shot, that. That's not a bad shot. That's just the ten or so left. What are you going to do now then? Oh, no, he's not even hurt them. Come on, Halberd. At least end well, mate. End well. You're fighting for the Halberd tribe here. Nope, that's a swing and a miss. Good work. Come on. Try again. Come on. Try one more time. They're literally looking at you right now and laughing. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. Where are you going? Where are you going? I think this one's uh, been on the beers before he's coming for a fight. He's all over the show. Put him out of his misery. There we go. Thank God for that. 2-0 to the stoners and a little dab from him to end it with. Beautiful. Right, the next battle we've got tonight is the headbutters versus the Jarls. Jarls, Jarls, Jarls. These little uh, dudes, dudettes, whatever. Pretty small little people. Their, their special move and only move is literally throwing their heads at people. And these guys are the Jarls, Jarls. Guys with beards and, I don't know, living bear heads on their heads? I don't know. Anyway, here we go. As you can see again, loads of headbutters in comparison to the Jarls. Here we go, look at these little headbutter dudes. I think now my Monkey Kings are out, these are probably gonna have to be my next choice to support because they're pretty cool. And I think anyone who can literally launch themselves head first at people as a means of attack is pretty cool me, I like it. So let's see how this goes anyway. I don't know how, I'm not sure how strong they're gonna be in comparison to the, to the we're gonna go with Giles rather than saying it twice every time. Yeah, I don't know how strong these guys are gonna be in comparison to the Giles, so I'm not really sure how this one's gonna, how this one's gonna, gonna go. But it does seem that if there are larger numbers of people on the whole so far, the larger numbers of one. So we shall see. We'll see if the Giles can uh, can break that trend. Hopefully not, because I like these little headbutter dudes. But yeah, we'll see. It does look like already the headbutters are all oh, two more in on him, are battering them pretty heavily. <coughs> Kicking off over here again, isn't it? Oh, saying that, the headbutters look like they've got destroyed pretty rapid here. These five look like they're doing okay against this guy. They're not letting him get a swing of his... Uh, if it's, geez, those axes are huge, aren't they? Not letting him get a swing away of his axe over here. The other, the other two over there, look like they've pretty much polished off the majority of those ones over there. Oh, I don't know. The ones on the far side still look like they're, they're they're putting a good fight up, but still no Giles dead, and the majority of the uh, headbutters look pretty wrecked now. How many are left? Maybe four, three over here. Oh dear. Headbutters look like they're gonna. Oh dear, two on two on three. Are these are gonna get finished off pretty rapidly now. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Come on, headbutters. This isn't good. Not even got not even got a killing yet on any of them. Doesn't bode well, does it? Hopefully, I'm not gonna have another one of my units. I'm gonna back. I think I'm cursing units by supporting them here. Oh dear. Wow. Well, this was um. Who's alive still? They look dead. There's one over there still. Is that the last one? I think so. Well, I reckon she's probably lost. And... Oh no! She's gone for a nut to the crotch. Good effort. And, oh dear, that was a little bit one-sided. Let's hope they can perform slightly better this round, because that was shocking. Right, one all to the jars. Come on, headbutter people! Let's do a little bit better than that, because that was terrible. That's going to have to make for a hell of a turnaround to come back from that, though, because they got absolutely battered then. Didn't even kill one jar. <clears throat> I think if they can knock one of these guys down, they can have a they have a chance. We'll see. But based on the last one, it doesn't look good. This guy's got his back to them now. Oh, go on, get him while his back's turned. Oh, the guy in the middle's down. Is he dead? No, he's not. They're all just headbutting him on the floor. That's just cruel. At least get him, let him get up and fight. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, oh I love the headbutts. They just look so cool. They're not always accurate by the look at this, but hey, you know. Oh, she looks like she's gone for a punch to the face. A flying punch to the face. Oh, nope. One in the middle there has just gone for a headbutt and missed. Whoa, she has been launched. Oh dear, I'm not sure the headbutt is even going to kill anybody here. If they kill someone, they might have a chance, but they're looking like they're really struggling to take anyone down at all. Is he gone? <gasps> one down. Come on, headbutters. You still got a chance here. There's one guy down. How many of you are dead over here? Are you all dead? There's some getting up. It takes ages to get up on this game. You never quite know because on this game, some of them lay on the floor for quite a while before they kick back into life. Oh, there's loads of them still alive. Oh, slap to the face. Great little slap head by that. Oh, a few of them coming on the back of this guy, catching him while he's not looking. 
Come on. Come on, headbutters. Here they come. Couple more to the back of this one on the left hand side. And another one. Come on. Oh, still doesn't look good, does it? There are a lot. It looks like it's still. Oh, I don't know. It's it's so hard to tell. Come on, headbutters. I hope a few of you are just laying down at the moment. Oh my god, there's one. Wow, okay, didn't see that one coming. Come on, maybe they've got some chances here still. Come on. Good start again. Get some good early blows and knock a couple of these Giles down. Maybe you can still take them. Maybe I've not cursed you just yet. We'll see. We'll see. This could go like the first round yet, though, and it could all go very wrong. Well, the guy in the middle, the jar in the middle is down, and they're getting him while he's on the floor. That one in the middle just literally threw herself at him. Like full body. Come on, Giles. Down on the floor, please. Oh, he's back up again, the one in the middle. Another slap to the face there, but look at it in the middle there. Oh, what a headbutt that is! <laughs> It's a great headbutt. Oh, there goes another one. Wow, they launched themselves from a mile back. You've just nutted your teammate. Oh, attempted slap from her. Oh, another attempted slap. And a headbutt to the midriff. Oh, go on. Keep it up. Keep it up, girls. Come on. Come on, little headbutters. You've got a size disadvantage, but you've got a numerical advantage. You just need to take someone out quickly. If you get someone down early while you've got a numerical advantage, then you've got a chance. Oh, no. Did you just kill three in one blow there? <gasps> One's down. The one on the far side's down. Wow, these are like seriously ganging up on this dude. Oh, look at the numbers coming on him. Come on, Ed Buzz. Come on. Uh oh, his teammate's coming in though. <sighs> How many of you are alive? You need to kill him off before his teammate gets there. Come on, he needs to go. You can't have two on, two on a big part of you. You'll get demolished quickly. He needs to die rapidly here. Come on, take him down, take him down, take him down. Quick, quick, quick. I think he's dead because they've, they've moved away. Is he dead? Come on! Oh, it's literally... This is the determined... Oh, he's battered them all beautifully as they've headbutted. He's battered them well. This is close. This is close. There's a lot of headbutters still, though. Come on, headbutters! Make up for my loss of my monkey kings. Come on. Yeah! Go on! The headbutters! 2-1. Happy with that. Great result. Right, final battle of the night, we've got the fencers versus the clubbers. So these fencer dudes look very much the uh, three musketeers, except there's a few more of them as you can tell. Big old pointy fencing sticks, look quite long actually, this guy's uh, buzzing to go. Let's go boys, let's go. These guys, kind of like Neanderthal man almost. Neanderthal? Stone Age? Well, I don't know, I don't know. I'll try and sound like I know what I'm talking about. Yeah, these guys literally just club people, that's all they've got. This dude over here has got an abnormally long neck. So he's going to be a bit targeted for that, isn't he? Look at that neck. Wow. You stand out from the bunch, buddy. They're going to target you for sure. Round right, let's see how this goes five. then. So as as per most of the battles, they're not they're not exactly even numbers. But you'd have thought the fences with their little pointy swords are going to probably do a bit more damage than the clubbers. I guess it depends how good the clubbers are. We'll see. I think the fences are a bit more agile than the clubbers as well. They seem to be quicker on the movements, whereas the clubbers are a bit more slow-paced and... They're more sluggers, whereas the fences are a bit more, I say refined, look at them, they're all over the show, so I don't know. As per every battle, you try and predict it, you get it wrong. There's no point in me even trying, is there? So we'll see how this goes anyway. Looks pretty 50-50-ish. This guy is massively outnumbered over here, though. Five on one, he's gone. Oh dear, <laughs> even, he says. 50-50, he says. Maybe not. It looks like the fences are kicking their butts. Let's have a look. Oh, he swept his teammate's legs away for a giggle. The cheek of that. Oh dear. Wow, okay, well the clubbers weren't really involved in that one at all, were they? Let's see if they can go any better in this round, because that was pretty poor. They did very little there. Let's see. Ooh. Lunges forward for a spear there. A spear there. Oh, this guy's just... He's killed his own teammate. I mean... What hope have they got if they're going to take themselves out? They, they can't beat them without doing that, but he just, just smacked his team out there with a club and killed him. Good work, boys. Good work, clubbers. Your time left in this competition is going to be limited with uh, with moves like that. It looks like it's going to be limited anyway, because it looks like the fences have... I don't know. I think the fences have got the upper hand. It looks like it, doesn't it? There's quite a lot of clubbers left still, but they're going to probably fight each other before they fight the, uh, before they fight the fences anyway, based on that move a minute ago, so who knows? It does look like the fences are starting to grab hold of this one right now. Oh, clubber in the distance there's been launched in the air. 
We're down to four or five clubbers now. Whoa, look at him go. That's a move and a half. They've got a bit of, bit of aerial ability as well, these little fences. They could be interesting in future battles, but they're through in this one. Great win. 2-0. Game over. So the results of this video. We've got the Jousters losing 2-0 to the Archers. The Halberds getting taken down 2-0 by the Stoners. My new favourites, the Headbutters, and my favourites of the tournament in my eyes, beating the Giles 2-1. And the Fencers defeating the Clubbers 2-0. In the next video, we have the Chieftains versus the Berserkers, the Halflings versus the Balloon Archers, which is going to be one hell of a battle, I think. That'll be a fun one to watch. The Brawlers versus the Ninjas, and the Hay Balers versus the Scarecrows. Thank you ever so much for watching, guys. If you liked the video, please do subscribe if you haven't already. Give me a like, and I will see you next time. Cheers all. Bye.